not to talk about changes anymore. Maybe I just want to continue to talk about changes. <laughs> no, Maybe we're gonna go ahead and hop in. Happening. We're gonna go ahead and hop into match number one. I actually they got ready faster than I thought. I thought we were going to be hanging out for another minute, but we are good to go. We're going to hop right back into this match with KK Boy, or not right back in, but start this match off with him as he lands down on the south side of the map. This is down kind of uh, near the toxic waste dump area of the map. No, uh, not able to find a backpack or anything quite yet, but he does have a vehicle, at least got an AR and a helmet, so decent start. He's going to need to find a bit more loot down here, though. Well, we can take a look where Big Bot Boy came down. You can see this uh, GW fellow, the KX9, ATV and around off to the side, hitting up different tents. Not going to go over towards Big Bot Boy. And then we have Koi Ovo and Nono Baya. I like that. Nono Baya. Yeah, this is actually one of, from back in the day, playing in this area of the map. This is one of my favorite spots on the Z1 map period. Uh, the U is what we're going to refer to it as and what everybody basically refers to it as. Ooh. Says, Ooh, shots coming in. No, no, going to take a couple hits, says no, no, and he's going to run away <laughs> and hide back in that back room, try and get healed back up. Kuiovo, he's going to go ahead and take off. He was the one placing those shots into no, no. He's going to run back, though, to get some more loot. He was trying to look for a quick elim, not going to be able to get the elim, not looking to pursue the fight, so he's going to take off. Well, night nine, Korea Yoshi. Korea Yoshi, actually a name that I've recognized too. He plays, uh, pretty sure he's played in the, I'm trying to remember the name of the server that runs all the tournaments for Asia, but uh, he's uh, one of the players that's played in the APAC in Australia region quite a bit. Well, he's got a good line of sight onto Zyle here. He's gonna peek up, starts putting shots down. Gonna fire a few, doesn't connect any. Looks like he already has a shotgun, so he doesn't need to pick that one up and make any pushes, but he's going to use that door as cover as best he can. Still sees him running up to the side. Puts a few more Whoa. shots down, but it does not pay off for him as Ziles picks up the kill with just a few bullets. Yeah, he's going to be able to take him out there pretty quick. Looks a little odd, just so everybody does know. If you see where it looks like somebody jumps and they go up in the air or something like that, it, it's not on the server side. No. These guys aren't seeing that. That's because we're connecting to a region that we probably shouldn't be connecting to, but right. we're the spectate system, so uh, you might see little things like that every now and then. Drama's gonna get deletified. I'm gonna throw that word out there for Rich since he deletified, since he's decided that was a word. If he's uh, out there somewhere, he'll be happy that I've used it for him here today. Uh, he's gonna get his Elim there, though, pretty early in the match. First circle, gonna be going down to the southwest corner. Not off the map, though. Full circle going to be in play. Players up in that northeast corner. They're going to have a long distance to travel to get over to that circle. But again, these opening gas circles, not a lot of damage on them. These guys should all make it. If you don't make it through the first zone, I hope you either had a bullet shot at you or basically if you don't make it to the first circle, I'm, I'm, I'm just disappointed. I'm, right. I'm disappointed. Very true. Very true. And one thing I wanted to point out when we were looking at that map was the density in Pleasant Valley. We have seen that consistently through all four regions now. And it's not going to surprise it, me if we see it in APAC as well. It has a lot to do with the um, with the actual spawn where, where these guys are loading in at. I mean, there's there's a, a metric ton of loot sitting inside PV. I, I would expect people to be there. If I spawn and I'm above PV, I'm not going to swing out of it. I, I, I can understand the sentiment to try and get away and it's uh, survival make it to later in the game, try and get more points for surviving longer, but it's, if you survive longer, you don't have the weapons to get in the fight later, it's still not worth it. You need some sort of loot to get you through the match, so if you can kind of get yourself your own little nook or cranny of this uh, this part of the map in PV, you're going to be able to get quite a bit of loot. Get yourself yeah. set up for the late game. I mean, that makes a lot of sense. It's crazy to me that we don't, I mean, we saw, what, one kill happen in there so far in roughly nine people? So it's surprising to me that we don't see more action early Nobody really, on this version of Z1. They're all trying to make it later into the match. Now, if this circle was sitting here and we're on gas circle 2 or 3, there would be just a hailstorm of bullets going right, out. There'd be right. a lot of different fights going on. But this early in the game, everybody's still got a little bit of breathing room. It's, you know, we're not packing 150 players into a... Uh, into a showdown, we're going with 75. Some opening shots there real quick from Goody. He's going to tag the car of Lucky. Not going to get any actual flesh hits, though. So it's they've got a little bit of breathing room. 
we're we're not seeing a ton of fights here at the beginning, and that's right. pretty typical. We're also starting because we did go ahead and work with players that were or not work with players that were way outside the ping limits. Mm -hmm. uh, we're not starting at the 75. We started at about 66 players, True. which is still giving even more breathing room to these guys for the opening circle. We can see how many people are over in Cranberry and on that kind of eastern side of Ruby Lake, and who's just across the lake now on the west side of this or uh, on the east side of the circle there's a lot of potential for battles here pretty early we could actually see a uh bum dick farm i'm looking at this i'm trying to figure out where this zone is going pretty strong chance that we can get somewhere in the center of that zone possibly have a bum dick farms finish we had a yeah, partial had one partial yesterday. partial yesterday where uh it pulled to the west on the last north america round where uh huskers took that down and correct Wait, and what uh, a game pole vaulted was. himself yeah. up into second place he was yeah very close to taking home the golden shotgun and taking a, an overall first i think it was twenty thousand points or something like if that. if he had had a better round one he had a shot at or it or if dish had had a worse game three no or a worse game anything yeah, that's really true. for that's dish true. Uh, but e drugs gonna be hanging out here nobody really taking any shots more looks like he's just trying to get a lay of the land big bot boy couple shots coming out can't not see paying attention can't see who he's engaging with nah, I, he's, he's paying attention he's just not paying attention to where he's driving i am 100 <laughs> percent guilty of that all the time ask anybody that's ever played the game or ridden with me my camera is never facing the direction the car is going but you're one of the best drivers in auto royale I do really, if all I have to do is focus on driving and you let me drive in Auto Royale, you are absolutely right. I do well in Auto Royale driving. Uh, normal driving within the game, not great. Not great. I mean, realistically, you are. But I also, I also have like springs in Auto Royale. Like, I can launch myself into the sky. Right. So. I think that should be the next thing added to this game. Like the we'll normal just, game mode? Auto, just, we'll just combine, combine Auto Royale. Auto Royale with, let's not, let's yeah. not do that. No. That's right. a bit much. I That's tried. a bit much. All right, Cuddle Cat going to be making his way across the lake here, trying to outrun this gas from Cranberry. There's a couple players that we saw back in the gas there. They don't have too far to go. They should be completely completely fine as they make their way across unless somebody like Cuddle Cat decides to stop and try and hold them into the gas. I expect them all to make it. I can't see why not. Super Narb, pretty far away from 403 as legend. And again, we're seeing a lot of ATVs, it seems like. Uh... Well, there's more ATVs than there are anything else on the match, so there should be more ATVs that we see. But the uh, the ATVs, it's interesting. I go back and forth on whether I like ATVs or uh, the pickups more. Mm -hmm. I still think I lean towards the pickups. I know some people that do just prefer the mobility of the ATV, right. but it doesn't have the same level of cover. I know you shouldn't really be using your car's cover unless you absolutely have to Correct. and sacrificing it, but... See, the, the potential for outplay on an ATV for me is so big because if you're being chased and you can seat swap, it is the coolest thing in the world. My favorite thing back on, like, original Z1 is that the ATV was a lot faster than, like, a Jeep or a right. uh, pickup as you come up next to a guy and he's like, oh, I got a car, it doesn't matter. And you just gun it out in front of him and then seat swap and shoot the guy yeah, out of the car. Exactly. So there's, there's some potential with that. I don't expect guys to be trying to pull a play like that off here, though. Here, no. No, that's your pub stomp move. But, ooh, talking about pub stomp, and it looks like Indigo Flame is very close to Cuddle Cat, and we were just talking about Cuddle Cat. I don't – I think they have a good idea. I'm going mean, to assume they know – they're practically sitting in the same way next to each other right now. They've at least heard each other. There's a reason they have both stopped moving. They're waiting for the other one to move to get a better idea of where each other are. And it looks Flames like they're the going to... I think I heard them both at the same time. They both moved. Skullcat goes oh! for the vehicle and Indigo Flame going to shut him down immediately. Punish Cuddlecat for trying to get back in that vehicle. Easy two tap. I mean, he definitely tried there. He tried to get out of the way, get back to a position where he could be safe once again. And, yeah, I don't think that was the plan at all from Cuddle Cat. No, I don't think, I don't think you're ever planning to get two tapped. No? You're, you might be expecting it, but I, hopefully you're not planning to. Fair enough. And you go Flame going to go ahead and take that Jeep, though. He's going to take off. He'll have a bunch of loot in there from Cuddle Cat. That's always the best. They get the kill in the car. The kill in the car is always the best because you're – able to just kind of drive around and loot it freely. You don't have to get out and loot a, loot a uh, well, I guess a Halloween lunch pail anymore or a candy pail. 
I can't wait to find out what the other ones are going to be. They said they're doing one for Christmas, right? So what do you think? Do you think little Christmas trees are a present? I want it to be a... Uh, a, a stocking. Ooh. I think a stocking would be cool, but I have a feeling it'll end up being something like a, uh, a, a present, like, box. A present box? I think that makes the most sense in my head. I'll we'll have to right. wait and see what it is, but um, I just, I'm just glad they're doing stuff like that. It's kind of cool to see it come into the game. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah, exactly. And I mean, they were talking about it this morning. It's not like it detracts from them fixing the game. I envy this man and his black Converse or Convays. No, let's not talk about black Convays. Because we all know that those are about to get that crate's going to be retired. No one will ever have the opportunity to get black convoys again. And those literally may be some of the rarest skins in the game. It's it's definitely one of them. It's one of the uh, harder items to get. I'm, I don't know. Uh, ooh, Night Korea going to get eliminated elsewhere on the map by 60. Uh, and we've got another player, it sounded like, rolling up on that fight. That guy was off of the vehicle and I could still hear a car. So we might be back on that with a fight here pretty quickly. Circle going to be closing in here. We'll it is going to most likely jack, yeah. pull out of PV. It should do a f fairly hard pull one direction or another here. Um, and there it is, is. going to pull farther to the south and more to the west. So we are going to be basically over the top of Bumjik. But it's going to probably start centering and it will eventually finish south of the road from Bumjik. So players need to recognize right now where they need to be for these closing circles that are going to happen. e is going to take a few shots out in the direction of, I believe that is GW, not able to get any hits though. Squizzy Boy right here next to him on his left. I'll have to keep an eye out for that, don't want to get pinched. Yeah, but Zesty here is along the edge of the wall for the gas a little bit. See, he's looking for it. I mean, right now, I don't think, he's not going to be safe. He needs to move closer to Bumjik at this point. There's so many people along the edge of this gas wall, though, that I'm wondering if we're going to see a lot of fights along the edge this time. I'll be interested next time we get to see the map uh, to kind of see the spread. A lot of people were playing outside the zone. I'm interested to see who starts rotating towards the center here pretty quick. Because right about now is when you can start deciding pretty close to where that final circle is going to be or where Correct. the where the final fights are going to be. I don't want to say the final circle because the final circle is usually those last two guys that's going to pull one way or the other on one of them. Um, it usually centers pretty hard on the last one, but in those last two or three circles, um, that's kind of the general area you want to be in and ready and have that best position to uh, set yourself up for a win right now. Well, Indirex is kind of playing the hunter roles. He sits in the middle. Now we can see that Beatty making his way over and he, I mean, he's close enough that E-Drug's name shows up, so he could be heading into a point where he'll find everybody. Everybody is in that general direction that he's heading. He's keeping his eyes on his back right now, but we do go right over because it looks like Mojao is in a fight, but so is Supernarb. Has Galaxy Destroyer right in front of him. Now Shotgun's coming out. He's trying to get away and he will not be able to. Indy finds the kill. Supernar gonna go down there actually at the hands of Flux, but oh, Flux immediately yeah, gets that. punished by a hunting rifle headshot, so instant um, avenge. That's a, an Avenger coming in for Supernar. That would have to be Hawkeye. That's Hawkeye? Yeah, Hawkeye. Hawkeye fires a bow though. Yeah, but he's the only one who uses a weapon. Well, Black Widow uses a weapon, but... I mean, he's a bunch of characters if we start going into him, right? Like not Deadshot? Avengers. Maybe Deadshot? He's not an Avenger. That's a totally different Whatever. universe. That's fine. No, you can't. That, that one's going gonna... to trigger me. That's okay. You cannot go DC with Marvel. That's all right. No, that's not all right. No, it's fine. As long as I'm getting the trigger point in, it's good. Yeah, I'm triggered all right. All right. Sweet. I'm winning. <laughs> all right. Plus Ultra Zephyr. Going to be hanging out here. Looks like there's a player down below. He may have been eliminated already. He's lusty. Going to get taken out elsewhere on the map by Big Bot Boy. It looks like Delusion was eliminated. He just hasn't logged out of the match yet. So Zephyr going to... It looks like he took him out on the ATV, so he's going to go ahead and grab that loot. We've got two players off of the Asia region, it looks like, that are in this match. And they're heading... They're basically side by side yeah, here. Yeah, two warehouses in Bumjack. So much noise. So I, much is I think around. at this point that... Once you know that the other one's in there, I don't think it matters if you move around. You're going to hear the guy try and make the wrap around to the other door. They'd have to basically do a full U to get to the other guy, so you might as well just go about it. As long as you're not firing your gun so much that you can't hear footsteps, should be all right. Squizzy Boy going to get eliminated elsewhere on the map, though, by Imperial Spratty. 
Mang Mang still in here. He was firing shots over towards the physical. Landed a few of those Magnum bullets. Ziles will go down Ooh. as B Hick Dog gets most of the work done, but the gas will finalize it and talk, talk, tick. Taken down by Pop One and now 60 in this battle with Spratty. Ooh. That nade will land directly on the top. 60 will grab it, look at it, and say, Thank you, sir. May I have a boom? I don't think he needs another. I'm no, pretty sure he got he his blew fill. Up before I got the other. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, there is no need for another there. Reborn trying to spray some shots over on this other guy on the ATV. Not able to get any hits there though. Watch me, baby. We did not watch you, but we do know what happened. You went down to the gas. And now right here, Mavidi is in the middle of a fight between multiple players. He has Zesty on one side, and the bubble is bursting. Ooh. He'll get taken out by Zesty. Headshot on the jumper there was Very nice. Clean. And then you can see so much is going on on here. One of these days I said I was going to rap God this kill feed. I, I don't think it's going to happen. It's just so quick. Yeah, I'm I'm not a fan of that that uh, that much that many words that fast. I, I, <laughs> I know I can't do it. I don't plan to even attempt it. V. Goody, though, he's going to get taken out by uh, Aben Baby, I believe is what I saw. <laughs> Look at the strats is here. The, this is, is legal? next level. The full lay down in the back of the pickup truck finds the like perfect little spot where you can actually go prone. Robin I like tenderness it. in a rough spot too. I'm sorry, Robin reborn tenderness. We're gonna see Royal Six Joy get taken out by Fusion with that shotgun kill, and KK Boy picks up Cesario. Now Imperial Robin moving away from that grenade very quickly. Elsewhere on the map, Nunyaba and Mr. Ob go down, and it looks like Robin will be able to get away and live for a little bit longer. Yeah, he'll be able to go ahead and get topped off here. Gonna hop back on that ATV and that, that, hunting, that rifle. hunting rifle still in play. It's gonna take out KK Boy. Another another headshot from that player. So keep an eye out for them if they make it into that final circle. We'll need to watch for them and see if they're able to make any big plays. Two ATVs passing the night. Say hello and keep going along their pass. Not gonna stop and fight each other. Fusion about to come inside with Wojow into the shotgun battle. And that one is gonna go the way of Wojow. He continues to hold down his warehouse and the kill feed is going off. Zephyr, GW, Slicens, Legend, all of them getting eliminated and many more. Abitron now Look taken out trace. by Sonder. There is just so many players. Sonder going off right now in the feed, getting a double. Nova Nick also going to get eliminated. We are down to 26 in a heartbeat. And we think we just saw Minjek actually go down to bombs perhaps because it said died to an explosion. So that may have been a thing. It's very possible. We're going to lose another player here. That's going to be Zhao Zhi. He's going to go down to ME1. Beno Baby going to find a kill on the Big Bot Boy, and we are down to 24 now. And we were at 50 just mere seconds ago, and there has been so much action since then. And now Imperial Robin has gas on one side and then a gas nade on the other side. Has a very hurt ATV to his left. Needs to be careful, does have orange green firing shots over towards him as Robin trying to get the angle, gets Ooh. a nice hit onto the body there. Was not a headshot, was just the body armor. Ooh. Now hits something over to Knight A as well. Man, I mean, we were talking about movement and how important it is, and unfortunately when you stand still and get stuck on a rock. When he was using movement, he yeah. was doing fine. As soon as he stopped to sit still, Saunders punishes him. Indy's gonna get punished as well. Bino Baby rifle. with a quick two tap. Now Benno boy is going to pick up the hunting rifle. That's right. He was the hunting rifle player, so we'll have to see if Benno is able to make work with it the way the Indies was. Indies had two E-limbs with that. We'll see if it comes into play at all here at the end. Out comes the throwable next to that ATV. He's going to be able to get away. It's just a smoke nade anyway. It's nothing to worry about. Physical going to come out. Looks like he's going to go grab that ATV and get ready to rotate right up against the edge of the gas here. He needs to move. Benno baby going to get eliminated by Aben baby. Baby on baby crime there That's as they take each other out. No baby on baby crime. That is that hunting rifle now in a pail. We're not sure if that was a close range fight or not, but Sakula's gonna go down as SD finds him in physical. Able to get in the zone, but it looked like he was getting shots at him. E Drugs, Kuovo, and Lucky all on top of each other practically. Right around the edge of that bridge, you can see Reborn off to the side in the smoke. The players are getting closer and closer, and we're going to break into our top 10 very quick. So we are down into our top 20, down to 18 actually, as Reborn Tenderness gets taken down by E-Drugs. So we are into the top 20, so all of these guys will be showing up in that top 20 board at the end of this match. Xiaomei, Zai, Zai, 
Pob 1. We're going to call you Pob 1 or Pob Low. He's going to get eliminated there in 17th. And we're coming up closer and closer to that top 10 spot, which all these guys are trying to get. You want to average oh. out in the top 10 to take home a prize. If you really want a prize, though, you're looking for that number one spot. Orange, green, Mua going to get taken out. And Nancy, 98, also going to go down. Sonder with quite a few kills. I think he's up to about four or five now so far in this match. He's definitely somebody to keep an eye on for the end game. But Zesty here in this battle with IPP, and IPP only had about four health when that was said and done. Takes that up, Zesty, unfortunate, goes back, and now Bin Baby taking shots from Ojao long distance. Hasn't been taken out quite yet, surprisingly enough. Nah, Shao Love, right above Night Nine. I mean, there's not a lot of zone left. And most likely, this zone is going to pull them out of it. And Ooh. a quick cod rush comes in from Night Nine. He had nowhere else to go. And it's Bin Baby going down to his teammate, Angsy. Yeah, as a close range fight, we are right on the bubble. This is uh, top 11, one spot away from that top 10 that everybody's trying to finish these three matches this at. Is the spot. This is a great way to set yourself up for the long game for the day. Getting into the top 10 in match number one's got to make you feel good going into game number two. Imperial looking to get an Elim here, and he is going to not find yeah, it in time. PP going to take that away from him. Meng Meng going to go down. Rain going to drop to Kui Ovo, and we are already down to eight. We are into that top 10 situation. I'm PP1 going to get taken out by Imperial AG AJC down to seven. And now we can see Ovo is going to get taken out by Skippy. We have six left on the board, and this zone is getting smaller and smaller. There is practically no cover. Maybe Saunder has some here. You can see 5MT in that smoke. So is Angsy in that smoke. AJC moving up through a smoke. Looks like Ovo's right there with someone else, but AJC will go down. Five remain on the board, and that becomes four fast. And we are down to the four, as you just stated. Skippy right over here to the right of Wo Zhao. He's kind of hanging out watching this. Skippy. Going to be taking some shots over to his right. It's almost like we're just going counterclockwise. Everybody's trying to eliminate the person to their right. Yeah. All right, we're going to play musical chairs. Eventually, one of you is going to lose your seat, though, and we'll be down to three once this next Elim comes in. I'm not sure Saunder needs to move at all. He may actually have zone he's, where he He's is. in a pretty decent spot. There's not a lot of cover except for the birch trees that you've enlightened birch me trees, to yeah. this, this week. But what's um, interesting is that Everyone He's closer is in to the front center, of though. Everyone is in front of him, which is nice. He doesn't have anybody wide left or wide right. Nobody really shooting his direction at the moment. Well, he's not going to have to move through the open, but once that smoke nade goes away, he's really not going to have any kind of hard cover. He's instead turning yeah, his attention to his right, looking for the shots onto Skippy, trying to find him. Woja now going to be taking that fight over towards Saunder on his left. That's going to give Skippy the opportunity to move up. This is a decent spot if it's within the circle. I don't know that it is. I think he still has to move a little bit. He steps out, going to take a hit from Woja. Down goes Saunder. We were talking about him having the great spot, but unfortunately that spot got pushed hard by all all three, and we are down to two as Wojow takes down seven, and we have Skippy and Wojow. We were hanging out with them for a little bit there, but they both decided to clear the other sides, and we are in the final gun battle here. Skippy barely getting away, getting the helmet back on. I can't believe that that is saved. The Molotov comes out from Wojow. That spot that Saunder was in, he lost it to, a, it looked like it was one of his teammates, and then it immediately got taken away by someone else, and that gas grenade going to force Skippy out. He's going to kind of stick in that a little too long. Comes out on the left, and Wojo's there. Ooh. Helmet Comes off on both. Helmet. And that's yeah. it right there. Skippy's going to be able to spray that one out and take a game one. Goes down, helmet off. Unfortunately, he, you Rock know, out. the other player was not able to find that target in the middle of his forehead after taking that helmet off of him. Going to take down round number one. Congrats to Skippy.